where today sixth ranked Alabama plays 14th ranked Penn State. And 6 and 0, oh, Alabama Crimson Tide. They won here in 1987, 24 to 13. It was Bill Curry's second game as the coach of the Tide. Bobby Humphrey now the 5 and 1 Penn State Nittany Lions. Coach Joe Paterno. in this decade they've regained their form this season five straight victories and today Alabama returns for Penn State he is on the prowl at the two-yard line waiting for Doyle's kick Doyle's kick comes to Anderson at the one-yard line he's got a wedge and he's down at the 34 a 33-yard return by Richie Anderson. State quarterbacks have really ever had high percentages because they throw the ball downfield so deep. On third and one, Sacco on the sneak has the first down for Penn State. Game and kick, because it may be a field goal type of game, Jim. Mm. Field it's a reverse to McDuffie. Sacco out in front trying to lead the way with a block. And McDuffie is raced down at the 24-yard line. Another Penn State first down. A and allowed McDuffie to get around him. First and 10, back to Thomas. Thomas dancing around, and getting inside of the 20 to the 19-yard line. Thomas out of there in motion. Swinging it over to Thomas. He avoids the first tackle and goes out of bounds at the 9-yard line. Oz 5 from the 9-yard line. Saka. Over the head of Daniels. And Penn State will attempt the field goal. That holder. Mark Lawn will snap it back. And the left hash mark. Tarassi puts Penn State on the board. Well. They used up over six minutes to throw to win. That's so three receivers. Hollingsworth right away, complete near the 30 to Sanderson, and tackled at the first and 10 for Alabama. Hollingsworth throwing it over, complete to Stacy. He loses his footing near the 35-yard line. So now lining up in the eye, two tight ends. Abrams joins Russell. Hollingsworth throws, complete to Russell. Lamont Russell near midfield, and another Alabama first down. Down, we'll call it 12. Big fake by Hollingsworth. Sean Wolf was after him, but he gets it away to Stacy, and Stacy's in Penn State territory near the first down. What a remarkable play by for four here on this opening possession. Second down or third down it is, and three. Hollingsworth rolling left, throwing, and on the ground pass. I may have been intercepted. I don't think it ever touched the ground, yeah. Pat. I think you're right. I think it was laying on a couple of bodies. The officials and all Southeastern Conference crew, by the way. Durant Stacy on the yeah. back, number 27. He slipped. No, there it did hit the ground. Yeah, you could see the ball actually hit the ground there. High. Saka going big time right away. He's looking for Daniels, and the pass is underthrown, and the interception is returned. Ephraim Thomas comes right back. And Alabama will take. Hollingsworth, his receiver tripped, and Henderson makes an interception. Vernon Henderson. That's Penn State with first and ten. Start out the second stanza. Inside gift to Thompson, a flag flies. So does the football. And Gardner falls on it. This probably will go against the Penn State line, which... Yeah, the umpire threw that flag, Jim. It's not converted today, however, on third down. They're 0 for 4. They do now. Lamont Russell picks up the first down. And then as a receiver, Hollingsworth drops back to the shotgun. 
on third and seven. Shuttle pass to Stacy. And Stacy about two yards short of the first down. They broke that play last week, 75. Right, he's going to attempt a 32 yarder to tie it. And the kick is good. Philip Doyle, the hold by Jeff Wall. Reverses. Sacker is hit and dropped by Lee Osmond. Blitzing from the secondary. That, that means they get, need to get to around the 36 yard line. Hollingsworth rifles the pass complete at the 36 yard line. It's Prince Wembley. And again, you see the timeouts. Now they run the football. Stacy. He has room. He's inside the 10. And he's just short. With two seconds left in the half. Darren Perry. And they're stopped. Martin Houston is stopped. Old Miss when they came rushing in on him. Missed a couple of games. Alan Ward replaced him. Now he's back. Didn't catch all of that one. McDuffie dancing around and getting near midfield. Back right at the 50. For the last two years combined, it was an 8-3 game last year. No touchdowns in that one. Alabama winning. So they've gone six quarters without finding the end zone in this series. Blair Thomas with room. And gets near the first down. He'll be about a yard short at the 41-yard line. <laughs> Third and one. Another reverse to McDuffie. And a first down. Didn't pick up a lot of yardage. But enough for the first at the 35-yard line. Second down and 10. Delay give to Thomas. Driving those legs forward to the 20-yard line. With pants on the tackle. Team. Saka looking for McDuffie. He holds on. Touchdown, Penn State. What a catch it was, too. Tarassi on the extra point try. And it's 10-3, Penn State. What you do with a great... This catch for a touchdown was his first from scrimmage. Jelks returning for the tie. He has the right sideline. Forced out of bounds by Bobby Samuels. But it's a good return, and a flag is down. Houston stopped by Andre Collins. Second and seven, Stacy on the carry. Actually, it was second and uh, two because of the five-yard penalty. From the 30, Hollingsworth, man open in the flat. Pass is caught by Marco Battle. And a gain of eight. Second down and two. Pitch to Stacy. Trying to find the corner. And he's forced out of bounds again near a first down at the 20. Darren Perry. It is a first down for Alabama at the 20. Midway in the third. 10-3 Penn State leading. Good play action fake by Hollingsworth. Has his man Wimbley at the 15 and inside the 10 to the 8-yard line. They do such a great job, Jim, of mixing it up. Wimbley was open by 10 yards. Second and goal from the six. Faking. Looking mm. off the blitz and a touchdown to Lamont Russell. Mm. Mm. Boy, he had a man coming yeah. right in on the space, too, and Hollingsworth got rid of it. Sharon Range was rushing in on him. He flutes, snaps. Back to Wall, the holder, and the kick is perfect. So, Third and 18 after the big play by McCants. Saka with good time. The pass is incomplete. No flag. 
No shotgun. Flanked by his two backs. Looking for a man open. Intended for battle. Intercepted. Perry. Darren Perry. He may score if he gets past this way. No, he's out of bounds at the seven-yard line. From the right hash mark. Saka still back pedaling. Now flags down over the head of Dave Daniels. In, in a close ball game, a delay a game to back it up fine. Tarassi, Ray Tarassi, just inside of that right upright. And it's 13 10, Nittany Lions. 120 left in the third quarter in our CFA action. Hollingsworth. Man open. It's Turner at the 45 yard line. Boy, he slipped going back third quarter with a 13-10 Penn State over sixth-ranked Alabama. Hollingsworth pass is caught by Stacy, and the Crimson Tide moves into Penn State territory at the 37. Jim has been a great fake by Hollingsworth. Dieter after him. He shakes him off. And now dumps it off to Turner. Heads up play by Hollingsworth. And the football is inside of the 30 at the touchdown passes from Saka and Hollingsworth in the third quarter. The game's two touchdowns. Here's Stacy picking up another Alabama first down inside the 15 to the 13. Tackle by Sherrod Range after the 12-yard for Alabama. First and 10, rolling. Hollingsworth has Russell at the 10 and out of bounds at the 7. Bumped out by Darren Otto. Game is a final. Now on third and nine, they run it with Stacy. He breaks the tackle, and he has the touchdown in the lead for Alabama. <laughs> Stopped inches shy of the goal line. This time he gets in, and Doyle boots the extra point through. Hey, Jim, even though it wasn't a necessarily a it was a surprise call. It was pretty well defended. It was all Sir Ann Stacy on that play. Well, for them. Saka with good time. Now rolls right. Looking down the sideline. And the pass is caught by Terry Smith. Wow. A foot. Inbounds. First and ten, Terry Thomas. There he goes. Side of the 30-yard line of Alabama. 23 yards, Blair Thomas. Hey, but the, he did trip. Third and 10. McCants trying to crash through. He's picked off. And now Saka throws it incomplete. On the fourth and 11. 11 and a half minutes left. To make it a one-point game to Rassi. He's got to hook a little more, and it does. Just getting through the right upright. That's a career-long field goal for Ray Tarassi. His third of the day, and it's now Alabama leading by one. Running with Stacy. Stacy. Near midfield, Robinette was out there yeah. in front of him again. Yeah. All right, just, I was just going to say that. First and ten, ten minutes and ten seconds left in the contest. Hand off to Stacy. Alabama's grinding it out on the ground now, picking up some yardage. They set Sanderson wide right, battle on the slot right. Turner on the handoff, first down Alabama. He almost stumbled. Alabama has held the football now for over four minutes. Hollingsworth intercepted. Sean Wolf. Rich Sean Wolf. <laughs> Second down and eight. Blair Thomas off right tackle. 
tell you what, if we get themselves in position to kick the field goal, and it's either going to be a win or a loss. Alabama may not see the ball again. Second and nine. Staying with Blair Thomas. Thomas, he's at the 29-yard line. Equivalent to a 39-yard attempt. Second down and four. Again, Blair Thomas. First down, Penn State. Into the 10-yard line. the half yard line. All right, Eli, we gotta block it. You gotta block this one. Yeah. If you ever block one, you gotta block this one. This will be a 17 yard field goal attempt. In is Ray Tarassi, the senior from Pittsburgh. 13 seconds to go. The snap is hot. The spot is hey, block. Hey, block. Hey, block. Hey, block. Hey, block. State. Boy, Blair Thomas almost did it for the Nittany Lions, but it's a 17-16 win for the Crimson Tide. 